Hello and welcome everyone to another exciting episode of the Super Carling Gaming Pokemon X Nuzlocke Challenge, where today we have got two pretty tough battles right in a row. Oh, is there? I think there's an item we can get on the way out of here. Ah, we have to be careful. I think we have to go back. Or maybe I am just mistaken. I swear there was something. Oh, maybe you have to get to that warp pad. Was that a thing? How do you get over there? Hmm? Is this a way? No, how would you get over to that warp pad? I don't know. I don't remember it looking like a TM, so I'm not really that concerned. Oh, and we're zip-zapping away. Oh, maybe this is it. What do you know? Ah, it was. Oh, so, so tantalizing. So stupidly just a hyper potion. Oh my gosh. Okay. What a, what a great start. Can I go on this? Oh, there's another fight? Well, I have to feel like these guys are probably way easier than our last fight. Team Flag Grunt Golbat. Mm-hmm. Yes. Hi. Don't know if you've met my friend, the giant hugging scorpion. Her name is Xerxen. She will crunch you right in your face. I'm just trying to get out of this base. I already beat all the bosses. So if you just step aside. Oh, cool, cool. You don't want me to go anywhere. That's fine. I got this. I got to go fight your boss. That's the thing. So the sooner you can just get out the way. Here it is. All right. Kaboom. Xerxes grew low 50. That's right. That's right. Strongest Pokemon. Oh my goodness. This is just totally been the Xerxes show for like the last two episodes. Uh, but today, I think it is going to be the Xylea show. Uh, quite frankly. Now, could, do I have to go? What? Does this get me somewhere? Are there? Are, are these people still fighting? Did I just do the, the game backwards? Can I leave without doing this? I don't want to keep fighting people. I just want to get out of the stupid base. Are we done? No, oh, we're done. All right, someone's going to be like, oh, you missed a really good item there. Probably. Oh, well. Okay, so today we have to go stop the ultimate weapon from destroying all life or whatever. I don't know, something important, I guess. It seems like just another thing we have to go do. But we're going to fly. And I believe we have to go to Geo Singe Town, right? It's over here, here, here. Mm-hmm. Come on, Tarth. First things first. Healing up. Yes. Heal, 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 heal. So the big concern in this episode is that we have to fight. Um a couple of Pokemon, a couple of Pokemon. Uh, namely, we're gonna have to fight Lysander, I think twice. Um, now clearly we are prepared because all we need is Xerxen to do anything. That's basically how it goes. Um, however, if we recall, his team is going to be all evolved from last time, which means it's going to be Mian Shao, Honchkrow, Pyroar, and Gyarados. Now, if you're keeping track, three of those are weak to moves that Xylia can drum up. We can surf the Pyroar, we can Ice Beam and or Thunderbolt the Honchkrow, and we can Thunderbolt the Gyarados. So that's sort of the plan. The only minor concern is that Mine Shao and how we're going to handle that one, right? So, um... You might think Tarth would be pretty good because, uh, you know, flyer versus fighting. Hold on a second. Sorry about that. Had a bit of a Luke emergency that needed some tending to, but he's all good now. Has not been feeling super good this week, but uh, in a much better mood this morning than he has been. Regardless, what we were discussing, I believe, was how we were going to defeat uh, Lysander. Mostly, that's the issue. We've got 
to get around his Mian Shao. So the question will be, I'm pretty sure we have to fight him first, and then we'll fight a bunch of grunts, and then we'll fight him again, and then we'll fight Xerneas. Um, and we're just going to think, I don't, now, the tricky thing about Xerneas is, I don't think you cannot catch it. Like, even if you knock it out, the battle will just start over. So you must catch it, but um, we so we can either just use the Master Ball and just get it done or we can try and like save the master ball for something i don't really know what um i mean i guess what do we have in this game hmm. you can get i don't know i don't know zach what's the what's the big zygarde i guess you can get that in this game um but i don't know i'm thinking we're probably just going to use the master ball in xerneas because otherwise we have to fight it down to the point where we catch it and it can, of course, then knock us out, which I also don't want. And it's pretty strong. So, yeah. So, Man Chow, though, we can either try and lead with Tarth, who is going to be, like, many levels too low. Or, uh, this is the problem. Probably just Xerxen, though, right? Like, I don't know what they could, what he could probably, eh, there's not this. Eh, like, we're probably good with just Xerxen. That's the answer. So, probably just lead with Xerxen, try and switch to Xylia, and take down the rest of the team. And that's going to be the plan. All right? Sound good? Cool. We've got all of our Moo Moo Milks. We should get some status healers, I guess. I think we're out of those. Bye, just in case. Let me get my full heals. Yeah, we need a few of these, don't we? Cool. Thank you. Bye. See you later. Bup -dup -dup -dup. All right, well, here we go. Man, the question, I mean, there's a part of me that feels like, oh, should we do some grinding or something? And then part of me that's like, eh, I don't, I mean, we've got Xerxen, right? Um, my concern is that maybe Xylia is a, is, my concern is for Xylia more than any other Pokemon right now. I really want her to be, okay. Oh, wait. I thought we were just going to have to go right in here. Did we have to go to Route 10 or something? Did they say that in the last episode too? Are we not on Route 10? Where is it? That's Route 10. So maybe we have to go south a little. Okay. It turns out we did leave this base prematurely. And now we have to go do this maze again. Hold on. Bear with me a second. We found someone to fight. We in Team Flatburn with ambition. <laughs> All right. I moved Xylia up to the front, so maybe we can try and get her some extra levels on these fights. That's going to be my uh, hope. That That's the silver lining, right? Now we get to do more fights. Surf! So that maybe we're a little stronger for our Lysander fights. Oh, trying to scary face me. I see. That might actually make the difference. I feel like so often they do that, and it's just like, oh, uh, never mind. Oh, taunt. Yeah, it did make a difference, but it won't ultimately have, because now you've been surfed, and you've been dead. See, that's why I got rid of Brine, because it's like, well, they, <laughs> we didn't ever have anyway, so uh, whatever. Oh, Dr. Crow, body slam. Nasty plot. Oh, I don't like the sound of that. Not one bit. Please paralyze him. Oh, we did. Excellent. Okay, so the other side of this is that I guess you could have fighting moves, which wouldn't be great. So we are, in fact, going to, I think, switch over to the Xerxenator here. Hopefully they just get full of Paralyzed and don't even land an attack. Venoshock. Well, that's really not going to hurt. Yeah, it's not very effective. No, duh. Uh, but bulldoze should be very effective. See ya. Yeah, you're dead. It's super effective. Ba -ba -da -ba. 
Well done, team. Well done. You've done well. Do, 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 do. Warp pad. Warp pad. Is this where we needed to go? Or is this where we've already been? Oh, there's an item. A rare candy. Well, that's pretty nice. We could give that to Xylia before the fight, I suppose. Just for a little extra juice. Hopefully we'll level up once, and then maybe we'll give her that too. And that will have done it. I feel like, how do we mess up where we're supposed to go, though? Like, this is... Is this it? Do we go up in here? Or this was the fight with the other two, right? So we came out of here... And then we're supposed to go, I think, let's try this one. Aha! I think that's the room we're going to, or trying to get to, anyway. Does this one take us there? Nope. Oh my gosh. Now I'm just stuck in a puzzle. Oh, we have another fight. Okay. This must be the right direction, then. <laughs> What you got? Talks are cruel. Go another one. Boy, they have them all over the place. Uh, yeah, we're going to do the same thing. Switch to the old Xerxenator. You got nothing, Toxicroak. You're going down, friend. Mm-hmm. Have you heard of boulders? Oh, I went for the sucker punch. Sneaky, sneaky, Team Flare. Oh, man. So the speed fell. I wonder if now we'll be faster. Nope. Oh, it doesn't. Well, <laughs> we might be, but Sucker Punch, if you're attacking, immediately does damage, so. Super effective. Well, he makes a cool sound. Yes, Xylia, level 46. What up? Lampard. Okay. You're going down, too. You got nothing. You're just going to get poison jabbed, and that'll be that. Kaswack. Yep. Just like that. So I guess there might be yet another mini boss we have to fight before Lysander. My gosh. This game, with all of its many obstacles, we're making it. We're getting through. All right. <sighs> Here we are. Maybe. Oh, you. There is another one. Oh, 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 oh you're that kid from the Frost Cavern. Oh, and you're lonesome this time. No. Oh, well, of course you're not. You have your Pokemon. Why do they even ask? Mm-hmm. All right, here we go. The game is on. Team Flab Mabile. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's very impressive. <laughs> have you heard of water types, though? Mm -hmm. Very good as well. Yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and go ahead and use the Surf on you. Foul play. Okay, that didn't do very much. But you've been hit with that rocky helmet. Xylia with her sneaky rocky helmet. Just dishing in a little extra damage all over the place. As always, as always. And then the Weavile. Mm-hmm, okay. Ice versus ice, as it were. Let's go body slamming then. Ice shard. Well, that's going to do exactly no damage, I'm pretty sure. Might have even done... Oh, no rocky. No rocky helmet damage. You'd think that would be physical and not special. Paralyze? No. Mm. What else has it got? Night Slash. Okay, let's see how much this does. The danger is, of course, the... Um... Forget the paralysis. Oh, we didn't. The danger is, of course, the critical hit there. So what we're going to do is just... Because if she hits us with that again, um, she's just going to die on the Rocky Helmet damage. So we're just going to heal and hope she does it again and dies. Oh, Ice Shard. You went for the Ice Shard. Did no damage, as expected. And now, we feel very confident in our Body Slam. Oh, not even gonna matter. Not even gonna need to, because you ran right into our helmet. Kaboom. Ka-dead. Ka-ha. Yeah. Thanks, Mabel. Well, she looks really upset. Ah! Oh, you're strong. You're a Pokemon. Almost certainly something I didn't finish reading it. 
Now, perhaps we can go an elevator key. Like, here's like, I don't even know you have the elevator key. You don't even have to give it to me. This game doesn't make any sense. Now we can go to Geosenge Town and use the elevator key and get down to the elevator and go fight the ultimate weapon or whatever, just, uh, just, just whatever the, whatever the thing is. Oh, we're stuck in this loop. This is fun. Do -do -do. Let's go. Is this the, that's not the exit. This is the exit. Hi! Or is this... Oh! Basement 2? Oh gosh. Is the fight down here? Or is this where they're keeping AZ? I think they are. Oh, there's Lysander. Listen, one who will face Lysander. Oh yeah. Big guy. Tall man. Captive. Uh-oh. Oh, there's a story. A terribly long time ago. Oh, we get to watch. There was a man in a Pokemon. He loved that Pokemon very much. He's still alive somehow, and he's really, really tall. A war began. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. The man's beloved Pokemon took part in that war. Yeah, I gotta tell you, your little fairy dude does not look up to the um, general toughness of the other Pokemon in that fight, dude. Just saying. He was given a tiny box. Mm-hmm. The man wanted to bring the Pokemon back, no matter what it took. Seems like he really had a hard time moving on. Built a machine to give it life. That's kind of, oh boy. Trying to reverse death. Always dangerous. He brought his beloved Pokemon back. Oh, did he? Wow. You just, that's a pretty powerful machine you got there, dude. Can I use it on my axe? My froggy ear? The man had suffered too much. His rage still had not subsided. Mm-hmm. Dude, you brought your freaking Pokemon back to life and you weren't content with that? That's like a miracle you've just achieved. He cannot forgive the world that had hurt the Pokemon he loved. Uh, but it sounds like you fought in the war. You must have had a side. He turned the machine into the ultimate weapon. Bah! Okay. All right, and just what, blew up the earth? Whoa. Wow, devastating. The man became a bringer of destruction that ended the war. That ended the war. Oh, the war was still going on. Mid-war you built the machine, I gotcha. The Pokemon that was given life must have known. Mm hmm. That the lives of many Pokemon were taken to restore its life. Yeah. Did you think about that? AZ, as, whatever your name is. The resurrected Pokemon. Man, this is like parts I just don't care that much about the story. I just like, let me advance through the game, Pokemon. It should not be used again. Everything will vanish again. Do you want to know unending pain like I have? I think he does. This is Az. He has the same name as a king that lived 3,000 years ago. And for some unknown reason, he has the key for the ultimate weapon hung around his neck. Dude, Lysander, like, get there faster, man. He has a machine that brings stuff back to life. And uh, he's, it's the same guy. Okay. All right. Guess we're going up here now. Yay. Oh, is there another floor we can go to? Basement three now? Even further down. Oh gosh, what is this place? 
Oh. Okay, so the Pokeballs we received and the Pokemon we've gathered are where they need to be. Add it all up and it means all preparations are complete. The only thing we have to do is put our plan into motion. I'm counting on you. All right. One push of a button and we can activate the ultimate weapon from this room. Okay. I believe being a chosen one means you have the potential to change the future. Whether we activate the ultimate weapon or leave it safely on the ground will rest upon if you actually have this potential or not. What? Why is why are you involving me in this? Oh, ho, ho. you're the one I've heard so much about. I've been waiting for you. I need to do a little research on you. Come, let us begin. That means a Pokemon battle. Blah. All right. Zeros, Zero, Zeros, Zerosic, Zerosic, whatever your name is. I'm not that concerned about this fight, first of all, because I don't know if you've heard of it, but it's called Ice Beam. Cross poison. Let's see how much this does. And if we get poisoned. And we did. Mm -hmm. So that's fun. But also, he took Rocky Helmet damage, which is the most important part. Oh! He almost died. Okay, here's what I think we're going to do. We are going to use a full restore and get our life back and heal the poison. And then hopefully he hits us with something that kills him via Rocky Helmet damage. Yeah, like that. But also doesn't poison us this time. <laughs> Boy, don't you love it when a plan comes together? I do. Malmar? Oh, this thing. Ugh. This thing is weird. It is like... Dark... Psychic? Super defensive? We're gonna try and paralyze it. That's what I definitely want. Superpower? What is that? What? Okay, maybe we can at least paralyze it. Oh, we didn't. Okay. Okay. That was definitely a big time fighting type move. And Xerxen is kind of hurt. Oh, you know who could do this? Because Dark and Psychic is weak to bug. So can Ashworth take a hit? If we could bring in Ashworth and hit him with a bug buzz... That could do it. We're at full health. All right, Ashworth. Let's see if you've got it. Of course, now he has a freaking attack boost. Oh, gosh. Maybe this was a mistake. Please don't have been a mistake. Ashworth. Oh, no. Okay. Okay. See, now we have a really bad problem. Because either we can hit him and he will go down super hard. Or he will survive and we will go down super hard. Oh my gosh. Like, and he's only getting stronger. That attack's only getting stronger. So, God, what a weird owl squid thing. Okay, Ashworth, this is the moment you were born for, my friend. I don't think we can risk switching because there's really no one else who can take the hit. You have got to bug buzz your butt off here, my friend. You can do this. You are the mighty Ashworth. You are definitely going to be faster. Oh, I'm so nervous, you guys. If this doesn't kill that thing, Ashworth is, my, is like almost dead. Oh, gosh. I'm so nervous. Oh. But I don't know what else to do because... I... Oh. Hit him! Kill him! Kill him dead! No! Oh my gosh. We did it. We got him. That was amazing. Freaking Ashworth. Freaking Ashworth, you did it. It's highly to level 47. Hydro pump! <gasps> oh no, see here's the problem, is that we can't get rid of Surf. Oh, jam moves can't be forgotten. Oh, lame. Okay, then no. Honestly, Hydro Pump is good, but Surf, I, I prefer accuracy over power, especially in Nuzlocke. <sighs> Keep old moves, man. Mm hmm. <laughs> My weird squid owl didn't. Oh, gosh. That was a nerve wracking bug buzz right there. I was so nervous i was like oh my god like uh, this is the only thing that has weakness to is bug type 
and it is like oh that was thank goodness for ashworth right there i will not push one what do i have to push a button to use auto order to cleanse the order it's fascinating do i have to push a button is that what i pushed a button okay I would have activated it even if you would guessed correctly. Come on, look at the monitor. What? <laughs> this is dumb. Why did they make you do it? Now I'm responsible. I don't want to be responsible. I just want to... I'm not even a part of this, guys. I just want to fight my 8th gym badge and go to the Pokemon League and be the champion. And in the meantime, you're doing this stuff. Uh-huh. Oh boy. There it is. The ultimate weapon. Uh oh, Luke doesn't sound happy. Ooh, scary. Mm hmm. It seems like beating that guy should have just been able for me to be like, okay, now I need you to leave. Um, I've got Pokemon and you don't, so get out. Instead, he's like, why don't you push the button? Ugh, such a smooth talker. All right. <laughs> All the cabins just literally fell over backwards. Like, <laughs> No foundation at all. They're just resting there. Mm-hmm. Great. Did you see that? The ultimate rubber is reborn. The poisonous flower has bloomed. Oh, shall perish except for Team Flare. How are you going to control that? How is only Team Flare going to make it? A victory for science? Yes, that's what this is. Science. All right, see you, dude. It's like the whole world, like, outside, like, now red and doomed looking. That'd be a cool effect if, like, everywhere was just like, dun, dun, dun. Oh, it is a little cloudy out. All right. Pokemon, Tarth, do a fly. Bring us way over yander to Geosenge for once now. Goodness me. Okay, now I think, let's go see if we can't freaking finally fight stupid Lysander here. And we're gonna put you up front to take down Min Shao Burr Zerks. All right, oh, there it is. Hey, it's big. Do I still have to take this weird path over here? I guess I do. It do, 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 do. Big, big weapon. Oh, gosh. Do I have to fight you? You better have come prepared, both you and your Pokemon. Oh, jeez. These guys are endless. Team Flagrant. Yeah, yeah. Manectric. Yeah, we've taken down a few Manectric at this point. All right, you guys all have the exact same Pokemon. <sighs> We're just trying to go fight the boss man all right do you know where he is because bulldoze i will bulldoze my way there oh you lived thunderfang mm -hmm. let's see how that does that better not paralyze me i'm gonna be so mad okay good we're good we're good maybe we should have swords danced probably i'm getting in a rush now it's not good that's bad nuzlocke mentality you never want to be rushing anywhere Always well, got to be thinking everything through. Oh my gosh. Why do they all have Scrafties? Why must they all have the Scrafty? It's such a good Pokemon. I don't like fighting it. Poison Jab. Ah, facade. Okay, well. Good thing we didn't accidentally poison it then. That would have been bad. By accidentally, I mean I totally would have been okay with poisoning it. Either way, you're dead. You can't take down Xerxes. He's too mighty. She's too mighty. And a Golbat. Mm hmm. Just on top of it all. We will crunch our way through. You had one for everyone here. We had a move for all of your stupid Pokemon. The crit. Even after we got rid of Night Slash. Boo! 51. Yeah. Just flying up through the levels now. Da -da -da -da, da -da -da -da. Behold, the moment of my defeat. Don't even think about blinking. What? What does blinking have to do with it? You really you don't want me to miss a moment of your defeat? Is that what you're saying? Okay, if you say so. Jonathan, I'm coming with you. Oh god, wine gums. Now is not the time. 
They also double the team player plans to do with the ultimate weapon. Come on, let's stop him, player. No, we have to stop Last Sider himself. The world isn't corrupt enough to give up on yet. Well, I agree with you there. All right, thank you for showing up. And for following me in. Where are you? Where are you? Did she come or not? Hey! All right, thanks for your support. How do they build this whole elevator here without anybody noticing? This is like a big digging job. Oh gosh, do I have to fight all you guys? See, hot, whoop, okay, don't mind me. Coming through. Big guy with the scorpion coming through. Ah, uh, hi, what's up? <gasps> the tree! Doo -doo -doo -doo. The ultimate flower has finally bloomed above the soil. Don't you find its beauty captivating? As we speak, it draws energy from the legendary Pokemon. We're not gonna let you use the ultimate weapon! Ah, I don't think that's the voice I'm giving her. But that doesn't give you the right to destroy everyone but Team Flare chooses. So tell me, the Mega Ring, did you share it? That's different. We competed for it. But when there is only one of something, it can't be shared. When something can't be shared, it will be fought over. And when something is fought over, something must survive without it. The only way to create a world where the people live in beauty, a world without conflict or theft, is to reduce the number of living things. What? It's a really extreme view on the matter. Pokemon shall no longer exist. You're just going to kill them? All of them? All right. All right, bro. All right. Let's just, all right, let's take a chill pill, Lysandra. First of all, I have a giant scorpion and you don't. So you have that to, you have that problem first. All right. Mm-hmm. There she is. There she is. All right, then. Uh, poison jab. Oh, maybe we should have healed. Oh, you went for the swords dance? I had that move too. It won't matter because apparently I'm faster than you. And I don't think you have mock punch or something. I guess you could, but it didn't matter. Good swords dance. Fun dance to watch. Funner dance to wreck you with. Yep. Yep. Gilados! Uh-huh. There we go. There's the intimidate. Now, though, okay. So here we come in Xylia. Hopefully he'll just use, like, whatever, Aqua Tail or something. I think his Gyarados has, like, Earthquake, though, which he might try and use because we have Xerxen on the field. Um, and if he tries to do that, then Xylia might be in for quite a rough entrance. But it's okay, we can just heal. We shall see. I guess I'm, uh, that's such a risk. It's like, are we going to try and overpredict the computer here? Yep, we used Earthquake. Okay. Xylia, you got this, right? You can tank that. Oh, no problem. I'm surprised that's not a physical move. Also, Thunderbolt. Outrage. I don't think Dragon-type moves do that well against Ice, but by all means, give it a shot. Hurt by Rocky Helmet! <laughs> Hilarious. Oh, super effective. Okay, so since he's going to get hurt by that again, because I think he's stuck doing Outrage now, we are just going to use one of the Hyper Potions that we found in your base. Heal right on up. Bloop. And you're just going to run into the Rocky Helmet and die. And that'll be that. Whilst we healed. All right. Hilarious. You're dead. Our strategy is working so far, you guys. He's going down. Now he's going to bring in Pyroar, and we're just going to surf this thing. It would have been pretty fun to um, Hydro Pump it, but alas. We didn't get to. Surf! Do it. Fire Blast. Okay. So this shouldn't do that much. I mean, we should be pretty neutral to it. It'd be really lame if we died to a Fire Blast as a water Pokemon. Oh, boy. But he did do a lot of damage. So what I'm going to do is do this again. Just to be safe, we cannot, don't want to lose Xylia here. Take careful note of how much damage this does. Fire Blast. It's also got bad accuracy, so there's a solid chance he just misses. Uh-huh. Yeah, I'm feeling pretty okay about it now. Because now we'll just surf him down. The only thing is whether or not this sets him up pretty nicely for his um, Honchkrow. Or if we should probably heal Again, I mean, we have the Ice Beam. The problem is that we go second because we're not very fast. So I don't want him to, like, sneak in some weird 
kill move here, like dark pulse me to death or whatever. So we're just gonna moo moo milk it up. Here we go. Scout out his moves. Night slash, uh huh. So what does this do? We're at 160. Did like 57. So we're pretty good. Um, let's just ice beam it. The problem is, oh, we're faster. Wow. I guess the thing is Night Slash is like a high crit. Okay, we got it. Oh, we crit! <laughs> there you go. Kaboom! Oh, oh now no, I've lost. Oh, he's lost again. Oh, not that it's going to matter. He's just going like, to walk away and be like, all right, well, nice battling you. See you at the next one. You're as strong as ever, but it's too late. There's no hope for you now. Go down to the lowest floor and see for yourself. Big J, let's look for the legendary Pokemon. Trainers are protected by Pokemon, but they protect Pokemon too, right? Look, you can see the entrance lover is over there. Lower, lower, the. All right. Okay, you guys. Well, I think uh, this is where we're going to call it for today. Uh, next time, I feel like I've been teasing you guys with catching Xerneas for ever now, but next time, for sure. We are catching Xerneas. It is going to happen. I can't wait. It's going to be good. Um, we're going to definitely add that to the team. Um, and that'll be good. Then we'll have a big old legendary deer on our team. Hooray. Uh, thank you otherwise for uh, liking, commenting, and subscribing. And just joining me in general on this wonderful adventure with our super amazing team of Pokemon. Uh, let me know, who do you think we should uh, replace on the team with Xerneas in the next episode because he's definitely coming on uh we'll see you then don't forget to like comment and subscribe and until then bye